Fool's Gold by the Stone Roses. The song is in standard tuning and it starts like this. <laughs> So we've got this lick and it comes in, I think it's with a bass, but then the guitar joins in. And we start on the bottom E string, three, four, five. Three, four, five. Then we've got five on the bottom E, seven on the um, D string. Play that twice. Then we're still on the D string and we're hammering and pulling off here. So pick the fifth fret and then pull off to the fourth. One, two, three, four, five. So that's. Then we're down on the third fret of the A string. So that's three down to two. Okay, so let's play it slowly. in this song so um, I'm not going to try and play all of them because there's about a hundred of them on there um, but they're mainly based in a pentatonic minor shape okay so if you don't know that scale it's five eight five seven five seven five seven five eight five eight Okay, and then we've got little things like you know, little licks like that. So, all I'm doing there, I'm playing those two strings, the D and the G on the fifth fret, and then I'm hammering down with my third finger onto the seventh fret on the D. So that first finger is barring the D and the G, and then I'm hammering down onto the seventh. Then I'm bending the seventh fret up and picking it and then playing the fifth. And then I'm picking back up to the seven. Okay, this is just an example. There's loads of different licks in it. So some other things you want to look at for your wah licks is some of the chord positions. So we've got that position. Then you also want this position which is 8, 10, 7, 10, 7, 10, 7, 9, 8, 10, 8, 10. Okay, and then some chord positions. So you've got that A minor there, which is 7, and then 5, 5, 5. And you've also got this position here, which is... 9 on the G, 10 on the B, and 8 on the E, and then this position as well, which is 10 on the D, 9, and 10. And then finally, which is 14 on the G, 13, and 12. And you can use a little right, um, combination of those chords. And those positions. Then we've got this other little lick, which is played on the bass with some um, wah chords over the top, but you can play it on the guitar as well. And then back into that riff. <coughs> so. On the bottom E string, five. Then on the A, seven, five, then down to eight on the E. So that's. Then we're going to keep the little finger here and play the eight still. And then that part is the same. So that's. Okay. And then we're down to three. Okay, so. 3, 5, 3 on the A, and then straight back into.
over the top of that, we have a lick that goes something like this. Okay, so what I'm playing there is this chord, which is on the 9, on the G, 10, and 8. And then I'm picking 9, 7, 10. So that's... Then I'm picking, which is 10 on the D, 9, 8, which is a G chord. And then I'm coming down here, 5 on the D and 7. And then playing 5, 7, 5. So that's 5 on the D, 7 on the D, G. So slowly, got that chord. Then we've got this chord. Then we're down here. And then we're back into. A bit later on in the song, we have this riff. So, what we've got there is these two on the fifth fret of the G and the B. Then five, uh, seven on the G. So that's. And then we're going to pull off 7-5, seven, 7-5, five, seven, five, and then pick twice on the 7th here. So that's... No, it's not, it's... Again, a bit later, we have this. Which you can also play here. So it's five, eight, seven, three, four, five. And that's all on the bottom string. Or here, five, three on the A, two, three, four, five on the E.